gentlemen, it's game time. Defense has always been a lot's weakness, and he looked really solid last game. I'm very impressed that he was able to transition into that role so fluidly in the absence of uh, Metza and Magnus. This is a best of seven, so plenty chance for Method to get the comeback trail fully underway. Here comes a lot good block, though, by a zero boost Reflex. Will we have another early blunder in defense? Flame looking pretty dodgy on the wall here. This time he does get the clear, which he was not able to find in the previous game. But everybody's on the same side of the field. No one covered in the far post. That should have been a goal for... Oh my goodness, everybody on Epsilon. Flailing at the ball, not getting shots on target. That's Flame going to look to try and get this one out. That is going to be in a dangerous... Oh! Too close! Tight like to was in the right position, but a little bit too far forward. Good vision by Flame to find a lot. He was looking a lot more aggressive in game two. Is this more of what we're used to seeing from him, waiting in the midfield, looking for the redirects to split apart the opponent's defense? Start to get caught in their own half a lot. I'll be able to follow that. Oh, and it's almost followed up by Tylacto. No contact means no goal, but Flame will continue to try and push this one forward a lot. Once again, getting there beforehand. Epsilon needs to not allow Method, despite it being oh, a what a to get the pace rolled up. <laughs> oh, it is all Method at this moment in time. One goal was all that separated the two teams in game one. It looks like one goal will be all that separates them in game two, unless there's a flurry in the final minute a lot with a great save. Made himself as big as possible. Once again, he's upfield looking for the redirect. That is a good one. One player at the game. Data is, however, standing firm in the way. But until now, Flame, 1-0 for Method. And what a great pass that was indeed. Putting the large ball up there, forcing two players to commit, and then took advantage a lot. Puts that one straight out, and finally Flame, very close to the side of the wall, expected the pass. And what an angle, slotting that right through the middle of the defense. All they need to do is keep Epsilon boxed into their own half. Flame does exactly that. A lot is up, but he will miss. Maybe one chance, and it will be a shot on that. Alex161 redirects it. It will hit the ground. A necessary touch from Alex to keep that away from the goalkeeper, but it did also keep it away from the net. 1-0 for Method this time. So Alex realizes he can't go for the bump, chooses to go for the boost instead, and Flame is a little bit too close. So now, once again, oh, this losing is awkward. control. Both these teams employing the same strategy. Neither oh. able to really get much. Oh, that right lot. there. A lot gets there just in time and pans it into the net. Tylecto was running interference on the goal line. See, Repix just evaded Demo, and then a lot comes from way above. Slots at home, his first goal of the series. A much closer series than I expected to start things off. I really thought if Method were going to have a chance that they would need to make a resurgence at the end of the series. But they started off very, very well, very organized. Players straight into the middle of the field, looking for that second touch. Very smart way of keeping the ball away from your net. However, it does mean that you are going to struggle to set up any sort of play a lot. Puts that one over. Oh, oh that might sneak all the way in. And no it will way. do indeed. A lot. Crucial goal. 92 seconds remaining. Was their downfall. That's a great clear. This might be a shot for Ty Lacto. And it is. And he's found it well. The crossbar down and in for once. I do not finish that phrase with the word out. Cross what a great out. shot. Off the crossbar, straight into the net. But Tylacto, the difference between how he finished game three and how he played this entire game four, it's just night and day. It's great to see the almost rookie stepping up to the plate, pleasing his fans who are out here in their hundreds, a thousand. And now... He's really struggling to score. Indeed, those mistakes it's bizarre. Come oh, there, there, there we go. Never mind. That <laughs> is a huge way to start the game. And the crowd really getting behind <laughs> their boys there. Well done, straight off the kickoff, winning the race for the boost. That is what I want to see from Method. They cannot hesitate. It's finally Epsilon leaving the players around, taking one player around. There is going to be the receipt on a lot on Reflex and Reflex on a lot. But that does leave an open net. Tylacto can follow it up. And for everything we've said about him so far, <laughs> you can wipe away it all. When you get a goal like that, that puts your team 2-0 up. It's such a crucial game. Great finish. In a super high pressure situation, Tylacto holds his own. Although, assuming that the continues into game seven, they won't be too disappointed.
Oh, oh I, I like though. Like oh my goodness. Okay, he's figured out his zone now. He <laughs> does not want anyone to pass to him anymore. He's gonna take it by himself. The series has been so low scoring, I've actually forgotten how to count pass two. Oh, will it be four? Yes, it will, a lot. Pretty much in a different continent, he's so aggressively positioned. That is some good trust that he's got his teammates. It might be five, a lot can find the back of the net. What has been the lowest scoring series that we've seen in a long time in the Definitive Elite Series? So, what are we going to see in our very last game? Ladies and gentlemen, it's tiebreaker time. Game seven is now confirmed, locked in. And you can play six games, you can play every game you want to. But well played thus far by Method to try and shut down Epsilon. Oh my goodness, the slowest follow on by Data. <laughs> Just floating after the ball. But for right now, it is all on method. What their response will be to coming down in the opening two minutes of this crucial final game. Method are only yep, launching come back. long. Oh, there's a big chance and a lot of flame, rather. Was fast to the ball, but it did get saved. Method needs something. Struggling, trying to get up, but finally, they're going to get off the back. Oh, put it low. Great save there from Repex. Does not pre-jump. Instead, gets himself there. Just in time, final 10 seconds. Epsilon must hold on. Once again, an early shot played. Last opportunity, but Tonex has played on the side. This is going to drop, and if it does, this will mean GG. that surely um, Epsilon will play through. It's oh my in the air, and then finally, Epsilon Esports claw their way to our grand finals. Solid defense, defense from everybody in Epsilon and shout out to Repix with a great goal. Just a little bit too hard for uh, Tylikto to keep out.